Hey, I'm the Seven Star General. My name's Caleb. Welcome to Muscovy for Third Rome Europa, University Else 4. And, uh, yeah, um, Muscovy. Yeah, kind of struggling a bit. Uh, the first king was king for a long time. Now I'm trying to regain uh, the forefront of military technology. Uh, Denmark's in eight, so I have to try to catch up to that. Um, I haven't done very well with the with the integration here. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, the Renaissance taking a while to get to me. So yeah, that stinks. But we're getting there. So we used our admin points to actually develop some pro to develop uh, four major provinces uh, in Muscovy, and uh, Denmark has taken over this area, this area, and this area, which is not good. And they are our number one enemy. Zan is also an enemy. Uh, we have a uh, decent military uh, strength. Uh, we need either this territory or this territory before we hit 10 uh, admin tech, and then we can become Russia. So that's uh, the Russia goal, in a nutshell. So, that's where we're at. It's not, it's not falling apart, but it's not looking great. Uh, Sweden has not gone independent yet. They actually tried to have me help them with independence, and I went, uh-uh, because -uh, I, I was not ready. Uh, I have some money problems that I have to get out of. Um, I have seven loans I need to repay. So once we get out of that, once we get out of the money problems that we have, should be in a better position. So... I got money problems. Let's see what we can uh, do to rectify that. Protestant Reformation has begun. Age of Discovery is ending in 120 months. Okay. Next is the Age of Reformation. So hopefully we can do better in that age. Uh, Bohemia. So I'm looking for another ally. Kazan and Ryzon. Oh, Kazan and Ryzon has declared war on each other. Oh! I so want to get involved in this. I mean, I guess we might as well use it, huh? Oh, we're right now coring the top part. Denmark is threatening our trade. We just got seven tech. Please tell me they're still seven. Yes, they are. Oh, uh, they're going to try to take... Kazan's going to try to take that. Unless I go to war with Kazan. If they take that, then Kazan is my new target. So now I almost want to wait and see and just play the money game. Oh, they went off the pile. 
Uh, unhappiness among the peasantry. Uh, let's try to improve their situation. Okay, we need to watch and see if they go off this tile. Oh, thank you, Brox Bomber. Um, they went off the tile. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to fund the military. Winter has just hit. Let's see, I need another ally that hates Denmark. Who hates Denmark? England hates Denmark. They're going to take some convincing, but... Improve relations with England. I'm open to an England or a France alliance at this point. This is our opportunity to take this territory if we play it right. Okay, morale is high. They have a pretender going on over there. We're at least very stable. Tiver wants to wants to come help us, so we'll 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 say sure. What do they got? They got eleven. So let's do this. This is a war of opportunity right here. War of opportunity. Gain some core provinces. So we are going to attack these guys. Try to take over this province so we can form Russia. Zan has insulted us, probably because we are taking over the area that they wanted. Uh, Tavers insulted us. <laughs> All right. Tavers wants to die. So you want to die. All right. They embrace the renaissance. Sweet. I'd like to embrace the renaissance. I'm gonna take a lot of money right now. Oh, we can raise war taxes, that's right. We could debase our currency, but I don't wanna do that. Not yet. So once we have what we're looking for here. Now Razan's actually looks like they're kind of winning their other war, huh? No, they're not. They're losing. And it's 20. Alright, let's get that rolling. Visor died. Oh, Crimea, uh-oh. Getting bullies from everyone coming after you, right, right. And, uh, Crimea is now going after, uh, Ryzen. Poland is willing to come to war if we needed. 
No need. No need, Poland. We got this. It's all good. Thank you, though. A little bit of support would be nice, though. A little bit of support would be nice. Uh, I don't need that right now. What, what do we got? The Separatists. Always the Separatists. Let's see. Sure, we'll use this. That should have knocked down, yep, 30%. One province would be affected. A negative 10. Need that Not at the moment. Walls are down. People laugh at our army. Yeah, we need a bigger force limit is what we need. It's all good, though. We're effective with it. Five percent, forty-two. Uh, we get liberty, desire, and subjects minus five percent because we're benevolent. Yeah, way to go, way to go, Idaho. Nice. Air Sebastian is a five-four-four. Gotta love it. We demand old rights. Yeah, we'll give them it. I don't think I gave them, like, areas that they control, either. Yeah, they just have the ones that was at the beginning of the game. Alright. I always decline that. I always want to make my own terms. Here we go. I want that. I want that. Huh. make them a vassal. What's the benefit of making them a vassal? Why does the map start to get dark and then go white? Uh, I don't know. Oh, because I zoomed in. Because, uh, the fog of war. Yeah, like, I only, I only know certain parts of the map. I'm zoomed all the way out, it shows everything, and then when I get into the province area, uh, that's the fog of war that I have right now. Um... They become my subject.
Or I could take it all. I could straight up just take it all. And 233 ducats. Uh, I guess. Why not? Right? Why not? Let's do it. Hey, what's up, Manny Morto? Uh, I'm gonna say let's uh, let's take their whole country. I I, I like it. The Muscovite conquest of Ryazan. Is a decisive victory. And uh, we are now ready to... Oh, I spent that thing way too early. Whoops. New diplomatic actions are available because we just became a great power again. Number seven, just above Denmark. So, and we just, oh, we were positive for a second. Uh, let's see. Mothball the forts. Let's move our troops out. Okay, we're going to have to... Oh, gotcha. Well, hope your, hope your night gets better or your morning gets better. Um... Okay, we have loans, so we got to get that done. Our corruption is growing. Let's repay that loan. We're going to try to root out corruption. We're going to drop the army maintenance. We need to get those things cored. Ah, uh, yep, I've had I've had many of those days. Sometimes I've just walked away and moved on, and sometimes I've uh, stuck it out, and I gotta see. Different every time. Okay, we need... The England doesn't want to ally with me. Protestantism entrenched. Neither does France. They can't. Brandenburg is getting air oh Bohemia would love to Ottomans don't know me. Denmark hates Bohemia. Right. The Ver did get me did get me mad.
we might turn around and just take them over once we core the others. Because we need to get out of this hole. It appointed lay members. Uh, if we appoint them, we lose five patriarch authority, but gain 50 admin points. If patriarch authority, let's see, then we can enact a. Right. We get through it. Then we can act one of these. We can do. Better institute embracement costs, national unrest, construction costs. We can put an icon in. Icon of Christ, uh, Pentacrater. Depicts the all powerful Christ, mild yet stern. One of the most popular religious images in our church is often seen painted inside the central dome of a church. Uh, sure. Oh, really? Construction and development cost. I'm going to go with that. Nah, I got to go with the... We got to get this institution to spread. Let's do the uh, icon of St. John. Queen of the people. We can gain... Uh, we have more important matters to deal with. Or we lose 15 administrative power, 60 ducats, and uh, negative 2 unrest. Yeah, sometimes what I've learned at jobs is when you've been there 5 plus years, they sometimes... Uh, they sometimes uh, take you for granted from time to time, thinking that you're trapped or that you'll always be there. True. Uh, let's do that, and then we'll have to take a loan out for that. Oh, we don't have a general. Grant a general till fifteen ten. Dang it! So let's uh, let's make one then, I guess. We're gonna go down and crush these guys. Let's repay the loan. A rebel uprising. Somewhere up here. Brandenburg offers an alliance. Brandenburg. 
you hate Bohemia. The Bohemia hates Denmark. You know what? Bohemia gets my alliance. Uh, we have a reform here. Let's become more like, uh, let's see. After the Muscovies, after the Muscovites invaded Novgorod in 17 or in 1471 and Lithuania failed to come to Novgorod's assistance, Novgorod was forced to accept uh, a treaty which further limited its independence. Ivan III, still wary of the uprisings, uh, because of what happened to his father, deported many citizens of Novgorod. He has also replaced many of the Novgorodian church with Russian Orthodox leaders. Lands were taken from the natives and given to uh, cavalrymen in return for military service. Um, after establishing the reform of land management uh, called the Amnesty System, there, he introduced it into uh, Mes uh, Muscovite. By seizing land, by seizing the local nobles called Boyers estates and giving it to his army, he helped bolster and centralize his power, create loyalty in his army and other servants. By 1489, Novgorod was a shell of its former self and now part of the ever growing Russian state. So, after reading all that, if we reform, we get a uh, better morale of armies and lower military technology cost to 1525, or we get trade efficiency and institution spread. And I'm going to go for let us reform because we need the military side really bad right now. And how are we getting beat here? There we go. I like it. And Bohemia wants a royal marriage. I'll accept. Got a Kazan pretender over here. Unhappiness among the peasantry. Uh, I guess we'll take out a loan to improve it. Yeah, don't be doing stupid stuff over here. The pretender can stay over there. Let's use uh, diplomatic power to make them an accepted culture. We got great horde separatists. I'd like to go to eight next. No administrative tech has taken a hit now. Once he gets into place, then we're going to uh, lower the maintenance costs. Gonna make some money here. Yeah, maybe it is time to wake him up a little bit. I know I've I, I've done that a couple times. Had a couple of bosses tell me, you know, basically that I'm trapped and I gotta do what they say, and I'm like, nope, I don't think so. But Denmark's starting to claim stuff. 
And two can play that game. Uh, they declared a war. I'm going to start building barracks here. Yeah, I got out of debt a little. Yeah. Well, I don't know if we got out of debt. We just... Uh, we stayed steady, I guess. Out of all that, after all that stuff, we, we stayed steady. Increased corruption by 2%. Corruption is zero right now, so let's... Uh, Let's do this. Let's the base. And then let's repay. So then we're rooting out corruption then. We're gonna try to use... Use the debasing of our salary to get us out of some of these loans. I could up the uh, I could up the production. do that because I don't want to totally unbalance myself here oh finally the estates want to control more About that desires of the flesh while we have successfully managed to keep the truth from the rest of the court it's only a question of time until it gets out unless we do something uh, Ivan the third recently discovered that his wife Queen Afaya is having an affair not only that but the other guilty culprit is none other than our advisor Akeem von Lacey Lassie, whatever. The trust we put in him is obviously unfounded. Now we know at least we can take measures to keep it quiet. We lose 10 prestige. Uh, we can, this cannot continue. Find out what he wants for his silence. Apparently it's 90 ducats. Ducats. The high treason. This is high treason and no less we shall have him we'll have his head for this. Plus three unrest. We cannot have an adulteress for a queen. She must go. We lose 15 prestige. And we have unrest and lower taxes and manpower. Uh, if we keep it quiet, we lose 10 prestige. Uh, I guess we'll take a loan for this. Keep quiet, dude.
And we just lost our claim on a lot of the uh, Denmark stuff. We do have a revolt. That's what I was waiting for. We are ready for it. Bam. We got it. Which is good, because then I'm going to defund the army quick. Then we're going to use... Let's see, what was it? Uh, we have Russian power, right? So I can then use this to reduce inflation. Is it from some shady people? I'm going to go ahead and take the prestige. So now we just need to get to administrative power 10. We do, let's see. Let's see. Cheap iron. We shall take advantage of this. We have a... Uh... Oh, look at that. We can build a uh, mortar now. Let's see. One, two, three. Look for the shortest days. Four. Oh, they're over my force limit. You're right. Look at that. Thank you. Thank you, Verdan. Maybe you're right. Maybe we should just chill out for a second and get our force limit up. That'd be a better way to approach this problem. We're going to go ahead and build that there. Thank you. Hope you're having a good morning. And then we need, we need this at some point. We need to start developing our economy. That's why we're kind of struggling.
There we go. We got an eight. All right. So we're now finally an eight. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and... Oh, it appears... Oh, he's now righteous. Yearly legitimacy, plus 1%. Nice. We're going to accept the royal marriage. Um, we're going to knock down the army maintenance. Still rooting out corruption. Revolt. Yeah, we'll lower taxes. Um, then we got administrative tech next. And uh, let's embrace this. Uh, let's embrace this institution quick before we uh, go further. Way I can stop. Going nuts about that. Let's see, Poland. How you doing, Poland? Poland, you're doing fine. Bohemia. How you doing? Doing fine, too. Bohemia wants to marry. Sounds good to me. We got a good heir coming up. We have a good king right now. I'm really wanting the money right now. Let's get the money rolling. Need to get out of debt here. Ostracon? New to me. Georgia is a vassal to Crimea. The Great Horde is almost gone. Ah, uh, yeah, I'll repay the loan. I kind of just automatically hit repay the loan, but then I realized the institution's going to take longer to... to happen then. It's all about trade-offs. Let's, uh, fabricate... Oh, wait, wait, wait. And steal maps. Birth of colonialism. This changes everything. Still need to embrace, uh, the one. And then get to colonialism. I can steal maps? Well, then... Five provinces, three provinces, six provinces, 19 provinces. Oh, I can't steal any of those maps? Then you're useless. Don't, don't show it to me then. Come on now. You're useless. Come on now. Uh... Never! Cola? Okay, how big is Cola? Button Arva. Ball. 
Bam, bam, bam. How's Sweden doing? Denmark's at war. What is this? England has hit a golden arrow. Hey, what's up, Index? All right, so we got a national decision then. Pass the Blasphemy Act. We can gain missionary strength. Sure. Let's do it. Means now. Still can't send them because they won't do anything. Oh, you just got off your game of uh multiplayer game of EU4? Nice. Yeah, I'm uh I skipped I didn't play any of Mandate of Heaven, so I'm having to, and then it's been, it's been uh, four months since I played, so I had to relearn how to play at the beginning at first, and I don't think I screwed it up too bad, but I think Tver's got to go soon. I think, I think I need to dissolve this alliance, let it ride. Can I make them a vassal? No, I can't. Right. Yeah, that's what I heard, too. And then they did uh, Third Rome for Russia, which is what this is. And so, guys, I'm going to wrap up this record here for YouTube. Uh, we are Muscovy, as you can see. And uh, we're allied with Poland and Bohemia and Tver. We took over... Uh, most of the Russian area, except for Tver there. Um, now we just need to get to Administrative 10 to become Russia. Uh, Denmark is our ally, or our, our, uh, our enemy forever. And, uh... So, whatever makes Denmark weaker makes us happier. Take a look here. Quick look at the great powers. We are number 7, Denmark is number 8. And then you got the rest. Poland, our ally, is 3rd. So, we do need to embrace the institution, though. That's where we're at. So, uh, and then we need to get out of debt. We're, out, we're in a little bit of debt. And uh, I still don't get these ages yet. But we'll get it. So, see you guys next time here on YouTube.